If you followed me for a while, you may have heard me talk about the one superfood I eat every day, even though it's not for me. I'm talking about prebiotics, my gut bug's favorite food. And in my opinion, using prebiotics each day is the ultimate way to support your health. Because when your good gut bugs are well fed, you start feeling better, metabolizing your food correctly, and find it easier to manage your weight. It's incredible just how effective feeding your good microbes can be and how great it can make you feel. In fact, that's why I created PreBioThrive, my cutting edge prebiotic supplement in the first place. You can click the link in the description below to find out more about it. And since I introduced PreBioThrive a couple of years ago, thousands of people have been writing in telling me how much they love the way it makes them feel. It makes sense because with improved energy levels, a slimmer, stronger body, a supported immune system, more efficient digestion, and radiant looking skin, what's not to love? But a few people have also written in with an interesting question. When I make PreBioThrive, it gets a little clumpy. What should I do? Now, I should tell you, those little clumps aren't a problem. They're just a reminder of how fiber-rich and potent this formula is. Because when the fiber binds like that, it's doing its job. That said, I understand it's not super pleasant to drink a clumpy drink. So today I want to share a few quick tricks for making your daily pre-BioThrive mix up and go down smoothly. First and simplest, mix it with a fork as you add water. The fork agitates the mixture a little more than a stir stick or a straw. And if you mix as you add water, you're starting smooth and keeping it smooth rather than trying to incorporate your pre-BioThrive with a full glass of water without making a mess. Now, if that's not working for you, or if you're on the go and sipping your pre-BioThrive throughout the day, try a shaker bottle. You know, the kind with the wire ball in the bottle. Shake up your pre-BioThrive in water or Vital Reds right in that bottle and reshake before drinking. This is great because pre-BioThrive tends to thicken as it sits and you can smooth it back out easily. Now, both of these are great if you're keeping things simple, if you're in a rush, or if you like plain pre-BioThrive. But let's say you want to make things a little more exciting. I suggest a chocolate berry smoothie. Yep, you read that right. And if it sounds like a dessert, I agree. Even better, it tastes like a dessert. But unlike a sugary, lectin-loaded dessert, this drink is amazing for your health. All you need is one scoop of pre-BioThrive powder, one scoop of ProPlant, or a couple tablespoons cocoa powder if you prefer, one scoop of Vital Reds, two cups of unsweetened coconut milk, a handful of ice, now, if you're using cocoa powder rather than ProPlant, you may also want to add a few drops of stevia, but that's up to you. Once you've got all your ingredients gathered up, the next step is easy. Toss everything in a blender and blend until smooth. Depending on how much ice you use, it may take 30 seconds to a minute. When you're done, you'll end up with a nice smooth milkshake consistency drink, one you'll try once and crave every day. Personally, I love starting my day with this chocolate berry shake, especially on 115 degree summer days in Palm Springs. But you can also use it to satisfy your sweet tooth or crush your midday cravings. It's great any time of the day. And because you're blending this drink, you 100% don't have to worry about any clumpiness. But rest assured, your PreBioThrive is still working to deliver you the best and powerful prebiotic fiber. Because you know, when your gut bugs are happy, your gut is happy too. And a happy gut is the first step on the journey to amazing health. A journey I'm thrilled to be on with you. Because I'm Dr. Gundry, and I'm always looking out for you.